I'm your host, Sarah Stevenson, and this is my co-host, Mike Stevenson. Hi, everybody. And for a, for a change today, we thought we might do a review on a TV series or a web series. This, in this is case. a real change, too. So it's called Aladdin, and it was made or released in year 2018. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, it's, you know, I want to explain. It's a web series. It's called Aladdin, obviously. Uh, it's a Hindi web series. Hmm. Okay, it's in Hindi. Now, there is subtitles, but we have noticed that the first one, we can't find a first episode with subtitles. So, if you're going to watch this one, just be, uh, just be aware that be the first episode doesn't have subtitles, but all the other ones do. And considering yeah. there's only about 400 plus episodes mm. so far, I think there's a lot of reading ahead of you. Well, um, <laughs> apart from the lack of subtitles in the first one, it does show a lot of actions that indicate, explain what's yeah, going on in the story. Yeah, you can see what's going on. It, it, it does set the plot and you can see what's going on. It's like watching a silent movie. You can see how the actions go and you can, get, you can pick up the storyline. Mm. And I think each episode is about 20 minutes long, is it something? Mm, 20 minutes long. Yeah. So, yeah. So, it's 20 minutes. First one, okay, it might be hard game for some of you who'd like to read words or hear mm. something. Um, but, yeah, it's not that hard. And the rest of it, you do have subtitles. Yeah. Who yeah. stars in this film? Oh, I thought you'd ask that. Now I'm going to try to get my n- tongue around Indian names. I will do my best. I mean, actually, okay. Mm. Okay, what I'll do, I'll, I'll do the directors and stuff first, and then I'll roll into the... Uh, Cast. Now, it's got four directors, and that's probably because it's an ongoing web series. Mm. Now, you have Man Singh, uh, Amandeep Singh, Kishal Awashi, uh, Vignesh Campbell, they're the four directors, mm. uh, written by Sakti Saga Chopra and uh, Lakshmi Jayakumar. They wrote it, and uh, the screenplay was... And Cal Agawal uh, Bassani. Hmm. I think they're the right pronunciations. If I have said them wrong, sorry. Yes. Now, um, as, as I said before, I'm still going down from my list of things. First aired in August 2018, still going strong today. Yeah. About 422 episodes so far. Although, at the moment, <laughs> they've gone on lockdown because yeah, the of coronavirus. the coronavirus. Yeah, they can't film, obviously. So they can't but film or even schedule filming yeah, until, times. Yeah, until, until obviously, India's had a hard away. go over there. So, mm. um, irrespective. Irrespective. Okay. Now, uh, cast. Oh, Lord. Uh, Sid Hath Nigam is Aladdin. Mm. He's not a bad actor. He's not bad. And they're good looking for you young girls. He's not bad. He's a, he's a pussycat. <laughs> now, Yasmin's played by Avnit Kaur. K-A-U-R, if that's the right pronunciation. Now, she's a good looking doll. And she's a, like um, uh, an Indian princess. But yes. she's almost like Sheena, the princess warrior. Or Xena, um, oh, whatever warrior, that, princess whatever that, warrior, but, too. Yeah, whatever, yeah. Or, or, okay, how about Wonder Woman? That makes it easier. <laughs> okay, now, uh, here we go. Amir Dalby plays Zafar. He used to be the former Grand Vizier and the naughty guy in the, mo- in, yeah. in the series. In the yeah. other words, the guy who has twickles his moustache in wickedness. He goes, ah! Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. He, he wants to take over as Sultan and rule the world and stuff. He, he, yeah. He's a megalomaniac, an idiot. Now, uh, here we go. Now, there's a funny guy. Actually, I must say something. This is, how do you put it? A fantasy comedy? Comedy fantasy? A fantasy comedy, comedy, a bit of action thrown into it? Yeah. Yeah. Because the guy, the next guy here is Rashul Tandon. Tandon? Uh, He plays Hassan. He's a genie of the lamp. Yes. He's funny, wimpy, everything else. He is... The most unlikely genie you would ever imagine. A little different from Will Smith <laughs> and a little different from Robin Williams. Yeah, and actually, so Aladdin's mother adopts him as another son almost. <laughs> yeah, it's quite funny. It's uh, He's a really likable character, but there mm. are several other genies. I will not go through the names because I'm having trouble pronouncing them at the best of times. Yeah, but sorry, I will guys. go on to. The lady who plays Aladdin's mother is a lady called Smitha Bansal. Mm. She's a very nice lady, and she's a very pretty lady, and mm. she acts quite well. And yeah, um, yeah, I think she's pretty too. She's pretty. She's, uh, but I mean, I'm going to say they all look Indian, but they are. It's not Indian. Um, but 
it's got a good feeling. They're doing an Indian web series based on Arab- a Middle Eastern Arabian night story mm. that our, we've, we've looked in our well, I did references, some, yeah. and actually Aladdin was actually, was it, it was an Indian story? Um, no, it was uh, Chinese? It, it was Chinese, Chinese story. Chinese. Yeah, China. So it wasn't really Middle Eastern anyway. Yeah, a lot of yeah. people have made assumptions that it's an Arabian Nights tale. But, yeah, it, tale. It, but it's just been dragged into the Arabian Nights uh, sort of stories, but it's never been part of the Arabian Night tales. So it's actually been a Chinese tale. Interesting, but in, in but bearing in mind, you got India is right there next door to but, China. Mm, anyway, mm. but then again, yeah. unlike mm. um, mm. there, I mean, if you look at the Ra- Arabian Nights tale, they do mention genies, and in the, if you go to the Bible, King Solomon mentions genies in that too. So you've got to in admit, the Bible, genies. Yeah, and they do mention it. Like I know they mention spiritualism and stuff and different yeah, things. So, yeah, well, so you're going to find in different cultures, there's going to be a lot of genie references. Yeah, exact sort of stuff. So Genies yeah. are, in other words, are demons that are trapped in exactly demons and stuff. Yeah, as servants begins, to and hopefully to grant you some wishes without any. Uh, uh-huh. Yes. Uh, what do you call it? Not loopholes? Uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> they get trapped. They get it's trapped. A bit like a monkey's paw. You just don't trust making those wizards, do you? <laughs> true, yeah. true. So anyway, um, so the interesting fact is, is about this one, this um, Aladdin's TV series, it came out just after they released um, the Aladdin live action of from Disney's version of Aladdin. We're not going to talk about the Wind Vista. No. no. We're doing Hindi. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. We might make some reference to it later at the end, but yeah. at this point in time, we're talking about this one. Yeah, and this is not the <laughs> first time um, in um, an Indian um, studio has gone ahead and do their own version of a lad. They do really good work over there, actually. Mm, they do. I mean, hey, hence would Bollywood. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, actually, yeah. there is, um, I was going to talk about this later, there is a Bollywood movie called Aladdin that was mm-hmm. done in 2009. That's also a Hindi fantasy action uh, movie um, and as, as with a lot of Indian movies for those people who haven't watched Bollywood before um, they're usually good mm. colourful they throw a bit of music in it because they like musical and fantasy and stuff so be prepared for the for, for a break in song occasionally um, but it's a really good look if you mm. don't mind watching subtitles um that 2009 movie is also a good look, mm-hmm. but we won't talk about that at the moment. We're going to talk about the web series. Mm-hmm. So anyway, the other um, Aladdin one I'm going to refer to that it was made in India too. It was made in it was a t- another TV show version, and it was done in year 2007, and it was aired on Zen TV. Okay, whatever. And that one was pretty an awesome one too. Okay, I haven't Although seen, I, haven't I haven't seen, seen too many yeah. of the episodes there. Out there, yeah. yeah. I, don't, I don't like ongoing episodes myself, but you do. So um, mm. I have seen some of these. I haven't seen all of them. So Sarah's obviously going to tell the story. Yeah. So more I'll give you a small on. cliff notes of the mm. story. So Aladdin in this one, he's a thief, like a Mask of Zorro thief style. He's a nice guy. And he goes out and steals from the wealthy and what whatnot. He does and, share, and she shares yeah. with the poor and needed. So yeah, yeah, yeah. he and he shares what's left he can give to his mother and to his evil aunt, I think. Well, uh, rent. Yeah, <laughs> that too. She's a nasty piece. Yeah. I, I didn't mention her name. She's um, uh, Gotham Khan, and she plays Aladdin's auntie. Yeah. Hey, she plays an interesting role. But, yeah, you know, it's mainly about a- Aladdin and the other guys, so yeah. we won't t- touch on her. Yeah, yeah, so she kind of... His aunt does n- uh, is aware of Aladdin's activities. Uh, only a select few people are aware that Aladdin is a thief and is a bit of a hero of Baghdad in, in its way. Yeah, he's a, yeah, he's a mask of Zorro who yeah. meets Aladdin. Mm. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so the one thing I like about this Aladdin is that they use a lot of bright colours, a little bit of, um, you know, it made me th- think, feel like a, I was a child again, like it's n- like an old way of... Filming in the this one. Costumes are wonderful, don't they? The costumes are wonderful, mm, yeah. and it's got this nice childlike filming about it, which is not too bad. It, 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 it's, it's, not, it's not overdone. It's not quite look. It's not quite stagey, but it's not quite polystaged either. It's sort of 
in the middle like it's fun. Yeah, that's what yeah, I mean. Yeah, it's yeah. like it's a creative type, independent type film. Yeah. Film I'm looking at. I think here. Sony's distributing it too, are they? Mm, they yeah, are. yeah, yeah. So they they wouldn't put rubbish out. So just be mindful of that as well. So it might be Hindi. It might be not totally polished, but at least if yeah. Sony thinks it's good. Well, yeah, I'd give it a go. Yeah, yes. I, I like it, what yeah. I've seen. So uh, apart from Aladdin um, f- doing his thievery, um, he's also fantasises on b- marrying the princess of Yasmin. Not Jasmine, Yasmin. What's Yasmin in this one? Yeah. Hey, by the way, I mean, she is a good-looking babe. Yeah, yeah. as and I said before, so she's warrior princess type. And But she's pretty. See, mm-hmm. it's, see they, they chose wisely. She's very... Um, yeah. Very attractive girl, and she does her ranks and bits as well, and she looks like she's natural at it, but mm-hmm. obviously it's choreography, but it all works together, mm-hmm. doesn't it? Agreed. Yeah. yeah, and of course, um, the um, Grand Vizier, or whatever, yeah, yeah. he has set his cap for uh, Jasmine. Yeah, he wants to get married to her so he can take over the, uh, the kingdom by yeah. being married to her, because I, the rules are, I believe, that if she, he marries her... He becomes the king if her father passes away. Instead of her becoming the queen in charge, he'll yeah. become in charge. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. But she wants to change the rules to have word to her dad that she will take over. Yeah, meaning she'll become, um, what do they call the word? Well, she'll be, uh, well without any jokes and laughing, mm. she'll be, he's a sultan, she'll become a sultana. Okay, stop the tittering out there. She's not a grape. Now, that's, that's <laughs> um, a sultana is the name of a female. Yeah, yeah Sultan and the Sultana. Mm. Uh, yeah, hmm. that's the female Sultan, yeah, or Sultan's yes. wife. So yeah. she becomes a Sultana, I believe. Hmm. I don't think she becomes a Sultan. Like, yeah. you know, like in Egypt with Hatshepsut, mm-hmm. uh, she became a Pharaoh. Mm. I don't think she becomes a Sultan. Because I think Queen is Sultana. So, yeah. yeah, so anyway. Whatever. So roll on. Rolling on. <laughs> um, Aladdin fell in love with um, Yasmin when he was about, say, nine or ten years of age. And he's he had has the pots his for ever since. Yes, yeah. and he has yeah. dreams that one day he'll marry her and so, and maybe make a new life for his mum if he can. Yeah, isn't that lovely? He's, yeah, a, he's he, a good boy. Yeah, and he, of course. The problem is, mum doesn't. Mum hates um, Aladdin's um, alter ego. Alter ego, which well, I don't know if he's actually got a name, has he? The the black uh, the the, um, bl- the black guy in the robe, you know. Um, the, the, I think he was <laughs> called the um, the masked thief. The masked thief. They will just try. She hates him with a vengeance because she has, she doesn't like naughty people. Yeah, bad people, thieves and stuff. And she thinks her boy is a good boy. Now, this chain, just diverting here, just a moment. Um, Aladdin is a good guy, but his auntie and his uncle are making him steal things for them. So he's yeah. they've actually controlled his. Um, Horrible career. He's uh, spiraling down into thievery, a thievery, and a, a life not so good. So yeah, um, they're not a nice yeah. family, are they? Yeah, no. no. But then again, there's this whole. There's also this backstory with Aladdin's mum saying that his father was a traitor, yeah. and that traitor, um, you know, caused her to get a bad, yeah. you know, yeah. caused rumors around the yeah, town. And, then, and, the, and his father, well, her husband. Uh, whatever his name, I can't remember his name, uh, was a- accused of something he didn't do. He was set up by, yeah. it was a Jeff- S- Jeff- yes. Jeff- yes. Yeah, yeah, the Vasir yes, guy, yeah. uh, who Jeff- was an evil guy, but he set him up and he has to, he's away somewhere, but he hasn't actually been able to come back to the city. Yeah, I think he was unaware that. Um, yeah, but he's not allowed to come back. He's just, yeah. oh, he might get arrested or something. Yeah, most likely. Yeah, yeah, or whatever. But yeah. Anyway, um, so. Um, he does sneak back. So yeah, it kind of causes a stir around the town, calling um, Aladdin's family not no good, or yeah. not real. Just Aladdin's mum and him are no uh, good. Yeah, well, you know, slagging off, saying, "Yeah, your husband's a traitor." Rah, yeah. Rah, rah. yeah, the usual sort of Which crap you get in these she, movies. Which means that, and yeah. after. She he goes to jail and do whatever. She has to put up with um this horrible bullying and has to sell anything that she has on you know, in her possession to pay yeah. the bills. Yeah, she has, does this have a little bit of work? Does she do something? Or she, has, she has a little bit of money hanging around. Yeah, a bit of money, bit but of, not too much. A little bit of cleaning or something or doing mm. something or for, yeah. Yeah, but all the time she's yeah. looking after her son and trying yeah. to provide for putting him. food on the table and stuff. Yeah. Even though she's um. Well, like good Vindaloo, hey. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, Aladdin gets approached by Zafar, and he offers him a career opportunity. 
of stealing something very valuable. And I'll give you 10,000 whatever they are, rupees or, mm-hmm. or whatever, whatever. Uh, whatever they are, gold coins, uh, if you do this little chore for me. And he thinks, ooh, 10,000 gold coins or whatever. That's worth mm-hmm. a lot of money. I can look after my mother then. Yeah. See? Yeah. He didn't say, oh, good, I'll go on a holiday somewhere. He said, I'll look after my mother. What a good yeah. boy. Yeah, so anyway. And this job, as we point out, is turns out to be a him requiring the lamp. Yeah, well, I can see that one coming. Uh-huh. <laughs> yes. So, after a few mishaps, he does meet up with the princess in also disguised as a thief or or another mask thief. You're not going to tell the whole story of the 400-something episodes, are no, you? No, but they do <laughs> run into each other throughout this movie and it's, it's all a uh, mix- web series. It's all a mixture of, of misunderstandings and a bit of... Um, yeah. Moments where they're in a yeah. in a romantic moment. Yeah, see, Aladdin thinks he's another thief, I believe. Mm-hmm. And by the time they first meet, it's all lovey-dovey, and you can see right in his eyes it's or in magic, hers it's that chemistry. it's magic. The juices are flowing, folks. Yeah, mm-hmm. and every time Aladdin says something ro- hopelessly romantic, she asks yeah. or says, um, "I say, quote, which song is that from?" And answers, and Aladdin's answers. It's not a song yet, but it is going to be one. This is a running sort of gag that comes comes every so often in this movie, in this TV series. Yeah, good old. It's a bit of a joke. It's an ongoing joke, yeah. But But it's kind of romantic. Anyway, you're not going to go into discussing too much the the blow by blow description now because. Mm. Yeah, we want to keep it down to at least under two days. So the series itself is like 422 episodes long. So far. And as I said yeah. before, there's coronavirus and they're and on lockdown. They're locked, yeah, so it's, it's stopped, they stopped production mm. for a little while. So, mm-hmm. But still, no, they will pick, pick up the uh, baton and run with it as soon as they're able to. And I'm mm-hmm. sure uh, there'll be another 422 episodes to come. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> funny. <laughs> hey, look, Doctor Who's been running for about 50 years. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Hey, this might do the same thing. <laughs> Yes. So as I was saying, um, there was another. Um, this when I think about this Aladdin, it makes me go back a few years to think about another Aladdin that came out in 1990. Not the same Indian style one that we're talking about. This one was done by um, an ex singer from the Monkey Group. What's his name? Oh, Mickey Dolenz. Yeah, 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 yeah. He yeah. did his own um, stage musical movie of. Of Aladdin back in the day that's before right. they were released, the Disney yeah, version. That's of Aladdin. going back a tad, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah but yeah. that's what it makes me think of because it's while this TV this TV series hasn't gotten too much media coverage over the well, years. Well, no one knows the, um, about it. The, yeah. the latest live action of it of the Disney one that came out just last year is got more coverage and and you just and it's a bit a little sad that it's, that this series never got didn't get very much media coverage when I well, think about it. we're talking about other lad movies while we're going through this uh, web series. <laughs> um, my favourite has to be the animated one with Robin Williams being the genie. I can uh, uh, you know come on, yeah. <laughs> that yeah. is <laughs> that's that's gotta be the one of the best mm-hmm. caricatures uh, mm-hmm. voiceovers ever. Yeah. So, and as yeah. I said before, um, the genie in this series um, is different from Robin He's a Williams funny little one. wimpy guy and he's quite, he's, he's, he's very interesting. Yeah, yeah, he is. Um, he's a little funny, he's a little bumbling, like he doesn't he's know anything mistakes about, and stuff he doesn't know how to use his magic properly. Yeah, he's always making mistakes and stuff and he's yeah. clumsy and And unlike in other, and nervous in other, and, ver- unlike yeah. the other versions of Aladdin where um, Aladdin takes the lamp, he says a us for millions of dollars. Or I want a castle or something or a palace. And yeah, 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 yeah. In order to impress the princess and everything. He doesn't do but that. But he doesn't do that in this one. No, it's, it's, a, it's a different uh, take on, hey, it's yeah, good. Instead hey, that, that makes it better because I'm obviously said, hey, gimme, 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 the show's finished. Yeah. Hmm. So you don't want to do that. So that's why it's been able to run for so long. Yeah, and it has a lot of interesting stories along the way throughout this even though Mike doesn't like it when it's this well long. I, I, I'm not into long web series I don't, I don't mind a three or four or five part or something rather but when it gets something like you know, I don't want to be an occupation and um, I got a, I, I don't have the time to sit down and watch mm. uh, that many web series mm-hmm. so yeah it's yeah. it's hard for me but I do watch the odd one with you in the shorter mm-hmm. and I have seen some of these ones I'm, I've been impressed with what I've seen so far, mm-hmm. yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I agree. Yes. 
but I, again, it's um, it's a web series. It's not a movie, so if you're going to be in for the long haul, folks, if you're going to watch it, but mm-hmm. I think it's worth a good watch. I don't um, think it's yeah. worth it. I've ser- certainly like the costuming, the colours, the um, special effects are pretty cool too. The food's good. Oh, mm-hmm. look at, I like Indian food. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, not, oh, sorry. sorry. I do think there's some lot of interesting things that 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 a lot of modern filmmaking at the moment is ca- is losing a lot. You know, the, the, you know, there's something we were discussing that the other day. Um, I don't know how to put it. Um, it's it's a, it's a gut feeling. Back in the olden days, you know, I'm an old man. I'm I'm 66. Okay, so I seen a lot of movies. I grew up watching movies. So even as a child, I was watching old movies. So. Um, I've seen a lot of good old movies with good directorship. I mean, a good director can bring some halfway decent actors up to the right level for a movie. Mm. Now, I'm not knocking the directors. Please do not take this as a troll job. I am not doing a troll thing. Yeah, as but we said in the past, we don't do, we trolls. Don't do trolls. But there's, I think the modern day directors are missing the point sometimes. Say, we're going to do a horror movie or something rather. They concentrate on how many uh, jump scares can we have, how much graphic violence can we have. They forget about the storyline. So you'd think if, if the, if the storyline's been written and the screenplay's been put together, uh, the director should try to make that come to life, not bury it. And some of these m- new movies I've seen come out, whether it's horror, an or a sci-fi or something else, hmm. when they're trying to pass off as an action interesting thing, it is no the storyline is so hidden amongst all the other things going on. To me, it becomes boring. So yeah, yeah. I'd, like, I'd like to see some of the old school directorship come back. Me too. Mm. So this one is pretty and going in. This the, is, this I feel this about. one yeah. is going in the right direction. Yeah, the, the director is keeping it interesting. Yes. yes. Mm. Yes, yeah, so um, I advise the directors and the screenwriters keep it coming, and we hope we'll definitely see you guys after this coronavirus is. Yeah, and I hope gone. no one. No, I was going to say that. Like I keep saying, that, I hope no one gets. It. I mean, it's pretty bad, or has been. I, I haven't heard much about India lately, so um, I like to think that it's, they're getting under control as much as they can. But mm-hmm. there's some countries at the moment that are getting resurgence at the moment, and uh, mm. second wave. They're calling it in some areas. It's. Yeah. It's not a good time, folks, and I'm really sorry that some of you are hurting and uh, yeah. you know, probably friends and family might be ill or, mm-hmm. or worse. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah. But anyway, irrespective, we don't want to dwell on that. Yeah, but, so that but this has been locked down for a little bit, for a few mm-hmm. months. But hopefully it will be coming up. But hey, it doesn't matter. You have to catch up with 422 episodes before you even consider it watching the new ones. And by that time, they would have made all the new ones. Yes, so mm. anyway, um, do you want to rate this um, series oh, now? Or, or do you have yeah. anything else to add to this? Well, not much to say. If normally we talk about the storyline, we don't want to talk about a storyline because like, there's, there's something like 400 episodes plus. And that's a, we can't go through every episode. Yeah, we'll I mean, be here I for do, days. I do um, like it that in, in, in oh, some episodes. No, I will say a couple of things. Um, there's more than one genie in this. There's, there's the genie of the lamp, which is played by this uh, guy I said before. Um, What's his name? Uh, there's Sorry also a ring genie, there's a bottle genie, there's a pendant genie. And all different stages during the episodes, uh, they come into Aladdin's control, I think. Yeah. And um, and he doesn't wish himself out of poverty. Yeah. Now, mm. he's not greedy. He's a nice guy. Yeah. So, yeah. Mm. I mean, there should be more nice guys out there. Yeah. yeah. I mean, and I guess it does... Um, but then again, in... When he got the lamp, he was going to take it to directly to Safar and and uh, in order and to get, get his, the money. Uh, but 10, he begins gold to coin or, yeah. rethink second thoughts about it. Like he found out that this lamp thing is his big responsibility. If he gives it over to someone else, that la- that lamp and the genie will be will be in yeah. deep trouble. Yeah, it could be. I mean, with great power comes great responsibility. That was the Spider-Man movie. Mm-hmm, yeah. True. Um, but this is how no, it is with, uh, in this one. He, he, uh, Aladdin has this huge responsibility to look after the genie in the, yeah, the and Yeah, he does. He, 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 his mother almost adopts him. 
Mm. I'm mm. a cute. I think it's kind of nice. <laughs> yeah. She's a nice mum. <laughs> we started mum late. Mum, yeah. yeah. Anyway, I look, I mean, we haven't got much more to talk about. Look, we might as well go for a, a short one tonight. Yeah. today Because we can't talk about the whole series. Like, it's going to take days. Yeah. Um, so what we'll do, we'll do is a quick one today, a quick, a quick podcast. I'm going to... As it's a web series, it's the same particular genre. It's not a mainstream film. It's not a B-movie. It's not, it's not, a, it's not a TV series. I'm going to say for what these guys are doing, and I think it's a reasonably limited budget because mm. I think that uh, over there, it's not about the money. It's about the art. Mm. Uh, so I mm. think the budget is lower than what you would expect anywhere else. Yeah, agree. Uh, and a lot of, they want, I think there's a lot of low-paid or even volunteer people working on it. Mm. For, for that, I've got to give it a nine. I think I'll give it a nine and a half to mm. out of ten too. So um, wherever you guys are in um, out there who are film doing the filming, um, I encourage you guys to continue the work when you when lockdown is done. Yeah, and by the way, I'm I'm sorry if I mispronounced any of your names. I mean, yeah, I mean, I don't know how to say them. Yeah, sorry guys again about the name I- issue. All I can say is the actors I've seen so far. Even the bit actors, yeah, the uh, not the co-stars, but just the bit actors. Yeah, the, everyone who's got the role to play is either very, very believable or very, very funny or a combination of both. Yeah. So you're doing well, folks. Okay. Yeah, sweet. So really, really happy to see it. I might try to get through the 400 plus episodes. I don't normally. Yeah. Uh, but I, I'll, I'll, I might give it a go, see yeah. some more of them because yeah, I they do are think interesting. it is interesting, mm. and I do like. That in one episode that I like to bring up is when um, Jasmine was testing Aladdin's love for her by bringing in her cousin to try to pretend to be um, Yasmin. And while Aladdin was paying attention to her, he suddenly still um, glue is still loves the real Jasmine. Yeah, lovely. I think that's kind of romantic when I think about that. It yeah. means that he loves her even no matter if she was playing being herself. Isn't it lovely? And I do like the whole this new feminist angle on Yasmin. Yeah, so just she's yeah. So I, I miss about so she brought somebody else in her cousin, pretending to be the princess hmm. to see if Aladdin was actually well, in love with the princess for in the name money. only and for money, but not in, not as a person. So oh, that's not supposed to. He still had affection for. Yeah. The other one who he thought wasn't a princess. That's interesting. Yeah. See, it's not about the money. He's yeah. not a money grabber. He's not a social climber. He's a good boy. His mum must have loved that. Yeah. I think so. I, anyway, by the <laughs> in, I think by the third series, they they then planning on tying a knot. I won't tell you in details, but that's what's been happening in the third season. No, give it to but much away. You, you have to go through 422 episodes. No. I know, but <laughs> as I said before, there's some interesting stuff there. Like They, they face mo- lots of dangers, excitement, yeah. and as we said before... Are the, this the monsters, this one? I haven't seen all of it. Any monsters or just genies? A uh, bit of genie magic. Just but genie magic. There are no monsters. Just uh, just but other wizards, like, there are some wizards that doesn't try that, to... Doesn't that horrible, creepy wizard lady at the beginning, that sorceress, come back into it? Mm, I think so. I, I think I read up that she comes back into it, but it's her, there's another actress doing it, though. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. you can't always expect her to return. She, I mean, after so well, many she, episodes. She just turned to stone. <laughs> and it would make an interesting <laughs> twist, just like um, Doctor Who, where he um, makes he, different... Uh, Reappearances in different forms. Yeah, but no, no. I think I think she, she was in the first one. That that was more of a cameo, mm-hmm. and then later on when they brought her back here, and it was a wrong going yeah. role, and she probably couldn't do it. So mm. anyway, it doesn't really matter because obviously uh, nope. it's a role, not the person. So yeah. Yes. Yeah, so mm. I'm just saying that in passing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. So do you want to finish this up? Look, I can't think of anything else. So like, without going into the storyline, like I said, it would be here forever. Mm-hmm. Um, so, yeah, look, folks, it's worth a while. If you don't mind reading subtitles, I mean, I, I watch a lot of European movies as well. Yeah, as, and I've watched a few uh, too. English-speaking movies. And, I mean, my eyes aren't really great, but I still enjoy uh, subtitles, movies, if they're a good movie. Uh, or even silent movies I watch. Um, so this would fall into that, yeah. Um, yeah, the same as you watch um, a foreign movie. Yeah, mm-hmm. subtitles. If you don't mind it, give it a watch. And and um, yeah, the, the the Cindy people, Indian people, are doing such a wonderful job at it. I 
think really you got to stand up and uh, and give uh, and, and and give them um, a bow, clap, whatever, or yeah, standing ovation, whatever you want to get, whatever you want to call it, because they're doing a really really good job. Agreed. Mm. So thanks for listening to this latest podcast, guys. I'm sure it's very short. Yeah, a bit and, shorter. We, and we, I'm we sorry for the um um hor- horrible time with us trying to say the names. If yeah. But, well, they probably have trouble saying our names too, so that's fair, isn't it? Mm. Yes. So, and thanks for listening to this latest podcast. Um, this is Sarah Stevenson and Michael Stevenson. Wishing you. Um, we hope you get all better, and hopefully, <laughs> we'll see you guys for stay our next podcast. Stay healthy, and have a nice curry. See you around, guys. Bye.